pretty sunset. Hey there. How's it, go how's it going, everybody? <clears throat> Good morning. I'm in my favorite city <clears throat> in the entire world. Memphis, Tennessee. Ha <laughs> uh, ha. It's 710, <clears throat> 711 right now. <laughs> Wow, I can't speak my voice. And uh, I'm going to go make my delivery now. It is that time. Finally, it is upon us. It's like 10 degrees Fahrenheit outside. It's cool, no problem, whatever. Not gonna complain again. I really want to though. But I'm happy to be delivering the load already. Um, what else are we doing? Yeah, that's it. I'm just going to start driving now. Don't want to waste any more time. Just want to get this load off of me ASAP. So that I can go back to a truck stop and grab some breakfast. That sounds good to me. Beautiful sunrise. Now we wait. Let's see, what is it? Mm, 8.15? Okay. I got a pretty full trailer. But then again, I'm the only one here, pretty much. Besides this UPS guy that just came. I'm sure I'm priority. Let's see how long they're going to take to get me out of here. Okie dokes, we're empty. I found this really bad truck stop that has horrible reviews, but... There's some good food places around the truck stop. It's just the parking at the truck stop seems to be horrendous, full of potholes and everything. But there's a Starbucks over there and there's some other food places nearby. So let's go see how bad it is. I mean, it worked out last time, right?
me if I don't get myself stuck. Dude, people don't know how to park, man. Come here if you're not comfortable in a tight spot. <laughs> See if I can go make a U-turn back there. The chance that I may get stuck. That's a risk I'm willing to take for some good breakfast food and some Starbucks. See if I can pop with you. See that area right there on the right with the pickup truck? That's the exit for the truck and it's all blocked off by cars. So just, just regular cars are parking over there blocking off that area. There's one tiny spot right there that you can leave or whatever, but it's like right on the edge. Hopefully no one parks there, because if they do then I'm stuck here. Let's go see man, maybe they got some good food. Hey, that's the reason I came here for anyway. I see Waffle House not happy but also I saw a Starbucks so that's that's cool I'll take Waffle House if I know that I can have Starbucks afterwards that's a good trade-off I'll go with that well I found a Papa John's across the street and I'm gonna place an order for a pizza no I'm alright I'd just like to order a pizza pie Um, I'm gonna go with a uh, small, uh, I think it's a, like a chicken, chicken barbecue, uh, and that'll be it. All right, thank you, Papa bless. Oh, all right, it's just across the street over there. Man, I haven't had Papa John's in years. Kind of excited. Go and get me a nice pizza pie and some soda pops. Nope, scratch the soda pops. I'm gonna go to Starbucks right next to this place here and get some coffee. I need something hot, not cold. But I'm excited about the pizza. Probably not gonna finish the whole thing, even though it's a small. But I'll have some leftover. It's cool. It's no biggie. Okay, well, I've basically been sitting here chilling all day. Um, I did get a load, but it picks up tomorrow morning um, in Olive Branch, Mississippi, which is like 10 15 minutes away. So, I'm gonna remain here at this truck stop. Um, because there's a lot of good food places around here and there's a Starbucks 
So I guess it's not a crappy truck stop. Truck stop then. It's got good food places around. It's just got difficult parking. Like this guy has a hard time making a U-turn. Uh, I think I'm gonna go out and help. Him. But um, yeah, if if you if you can't deal with tight spots, this is not a good place to go. Um, but it's got good food places. Anyways, I'm gonna go help this guy out. Yeah.